Hey guys, so I'm going to take you through the Hermes in the making event. Um, I was invited uh, to attend this, so this is at the Marina Bay Sands, um, you know, convention center, shopping mall here in Singapore, and um, it looks really nice. It's like a full cool house, and I'm here at the first, uh, you can see, like, because it's got like separate stalls, or like, uh, they were catch out the artisans here, and the first one that I can see is separating the so, um, you know, what they do here is that they like separate the colors when it comes to printing scarves and um, the, the pictures that are painted and printed. So, this area explains all of that. So, it's, it's really pretty, of course, with colors. You know how wonderful the Hermes plays with colors. So, I'm going to now take you to the next one. So, I'm just going to talk about a little uh, stall each at a time because there are quite a few areas to get through to. Next is their, um, this is like the threads. Um, there's not much going on here, but like they are talking about the threads and the colors and how things are picked out. So, you've got some people sitting here, you know, and all the activity that's going on. It's done really well. Um, it's organized really well. It's been here for like eight days, and um, I couldn't get time to come in here here, so I am attending today. This one is really interesting. This is the repairing object. This is where they repair all the um, leather-associated things. If it's some simple stuff, they repair it here in Singapore. If it's something really fancy, then of course I need to send it to France. But the lady here, she works in Singapore. each and every artisan and it's really nice because you can just go up and you can have a look at um, you know each area and speak to the artisan and ask them you know what their area expertise the are or is and um, you know yeah I'm just gonna slowly walk you through each and every area and try and explain as much as I can because I feel like there are a lot of people so um, you know, can't even like push through and speak to the artisans as well. Okay, this area is the most interesting. So I did get a close-up of this as well, which I will put up in a separate video. This is how they make the leather. So basically, you have the lady here. She has stitched all of this by herself, and they've explained to us how the pieces of the Birkin or the Kelly all have in separate leather parts. The medicine is right here. She'll hand stitch this. I will definitely be adding photos of this on my Instagram. Let's move along right here. And here we've got 
about the making gloves, um, you know, stalls. So this is basically how to make the gloves. We've got all the tools here. We don't have any artisan right here, but you can see all these little tools that are kept. Um, it's just amazing how um, everything's handcrafted and everything's like so precise. Um, so you can see all these little um, gloves here. We So this is cocoon basically. So it's a cocoon um, which is spun by of course the silkworms and then they use that for printing and coloring, you know, the whole process. It's just so stunning. Um, and here is of course the silk that they use on those scarves. Um, yeah, it's displayed right here. It looks really nice. It's, it's just so beautiful, the cloth itself and the way the color is then printed onto this. It's like a whole process. 
got some horn and lacquer jewelry here. Again, this is all um, handmade. We know that it's all crafted, you know, individually. So here they've got some cashmere, right? So this is all woven cashmere, which is again used for printing. Same just like the silk displays that we saw at the back. And here you can see the cashmere that's also hanging. Let's move right along. So here you basically have, um, you know, calfskin. So you basically are, it's a swing. And then you of course got a saddle tree, you've got a, you've got a chair, you've got a little dog monument. This is all made out of calfskin. So um, I'll show you around. They even have a giant um, Kelly hat and a, a, a giant um, Birkin displayed as well. So I'll show you guys that as well. So let's, let me slowly take you around this display and you guys can have a look. Again, all handmade, so intricate. So beautiful, all displayed so nicely. <laughs> here you've got the dog. That's a little swing. I'll take you along to where the bags are also displayed. Also, of course, made out of calfskin. So you've got all the different leather pieces right here. Are these all the different leathers, like Epsom and... Um, yes, so this is actually the different kinds of calf leather. All the different yeah. calf leather, okay, how wonderful. So Epsom was maybe this one. Epsom is this one, okay. So you've got the giant bags right here. Oh, these look so nice. Let me let me take you guys on the other side so you can read out the names as well. Here you've got your giant Birkin. porcelain right here so they've shown you like how the porcelain like what the porcelain is and all the crockery that's made out of the porcelain and water you know the change tray this is of course again very very hard to get in store so you've got the change tray you've got the orient vase right here as well and here are all the different porcelains that are displayed these are all the porcelain that's been printed on, so absolutely stunning. They've got no artisan here, otherwise I would definitely have some questions for him. And just look at that color. The way the color sits on this porcelain, I don't think anyone does color better than Hermes. I mean, the color is just so saturated. It's, it's so stunning. Oh, lovely. Absolutely beautiful. And I'll walk you guys through where the printing, the silk, and so these are all the scarves that they print um, you know there's a lot of crowd here before so I couldn't watch the um, printing on the scarves but they printed these right here and all the colors just displayed so beautiful yeah that's about it you guys I hope you enjoyed today's video I wanted to make sure that I filmed all of this for you guys so if anybody who has not been to this event could have a look and see, um, you know, what there is to be, uh, you know, seen. Uh, it's definitely been a really um, interesting experience. Um, I don't own any back from Hermes, but definitely, um, you know, the more I have, um, you know, now seen people carrying Birkins and Kelly's, and after coming down to this event, I really think I need to <laughs> invest in one. It's just, it's, it's, I mean, I understand the prestige of the brand. Um, everything is just done so 
um, carefully. It's so intricate. It's, it's handmade. There's so much effort with each artisan spending like more than I don't know how many hours on each bag or um, each you know um, stitch that they're putting. Absolutely stunning. It's it's been such a def beautiful experience. So I'll see you guys in my next one. And like I said, I hope you should enjoy today's video. Bye, guys.